God, it will never hurt to be here more than what you have done. But fire is out, but in the heart and mind and head of everybody, there's a fire. Trust not. We have put everything in this space and we have lost our race on the ground. It happens to all countries. It happens to all people. You were subjected to three days. That is the beginning, not the end. And it has been happening occasionally. It will happen again. The law is when a human find disparity, then anger increases. And it's one of the most tragic things which has happened is they have burned their own area and own homes. I mean, that's the extreme anger. Last night there was a war between gangs and police and this will continue. Fact is, we have not served the American dream. We have become congested and inhuman. When I say to you, if you cannot see God in all, you cannot see God at all, you think it's a joke. No, it is true. In every worse person, God is as good. When people mock at me, when somebody says, spare some money, and I don't pass and give him, my security get mad at me. That's true. It's a risk. Person can poke a knife in your stomach. But after all, maybe somebody has a body and God in it asking you to give. Nanak says, Jeto Baksha Miljata Tui Baksha Jai. If somebody blessed meets you, maybe you get blessed. I was in Europe, I watched this on television. You were here, you watched it here. But I say it in 1972, I said this will happen. You never believed then, why should you believe now? And if I say it is not stopped, you never believe what I have been telling you. Why should you believe now? The fight between the haves and have-nots is a very simple fight. I don't understand how you people even live. Putting down everybody, negating everybody, finding faults with everybody, pushing everybody's buttons, <coughs> showing off, Healthy shows his health, wealthy shows his wealth, intelligent person shows his wisdom. Yogis show their yoga, my way is my way, come, come, come. And then what day, people who are mad, they come. It becomes a mob. And then there's nothing. It's all gone. The purpose of Kundalini Yoga was not to collect students and charge. We have to charge money because this rent has to be paid and all this nonsense is there. <clears throat> you don't understand actually the first fundamental principle of life. Purpose of Kundalini Yoga was transformation. Not between man and God, transformation between God and God, that is between a human and a human, come to a mutual understanding that each one has a soul and each one has a God. When somebody is mad man, you deny it. Somebody is bad, you deny it. Somebody is black, you deny it. Somebody is yellow, you deny it. 
you still call me Indian as I'm still eating flies. You know, you get mad at me all the time. It's not something unusual. But God, you have two years. Have you ever heard what I have said? You love me, you like me, you play these games. But do you understand what I'm saying? I'm saying you are complete. You don't believe it. I'm saying the perfect God made you perfect in his own image, with his own hand. You're made in God. You don't believe it. I tell you there's nothing wrong with you. You don't believe it. Because you got to play this empathy, sympathy game. You, if you cannot play that game, you cannot digest your food. You have to put down some people, and then you have to put up some people. Why? Did you make anybody? God made everybody. The idea, the purpose of life is you should transform your consciousness into the consciousness of another person and understand on a mutual ground so that there can be peace. There cannot be peace in fighting stupidity with stupidity. And when you show off your I, you are qualified, certified, notarized, stupid. I is the sign of stupidity. We and us is the sign of reality. <coughs> and thou is the sign of infinity. Otherwise, go to some church and pray and hallelujah and go to a synagogue and in the morning we had a Gurdwara. Do all that tricks. You will never find God. Because you don't have vitality. When you don't have inside vitality, you can't enjoy virtues. And you're so stupid as a human being. By big houses, by courtyard, and by cars, and by dollars, and by money, and by everything. And uh, laying your wraps. You think you can convince the whole world that you're empty? You are empty inside. As a fact. When ocean is calm, there are no tidal waves. When earth is revolving in harmony, there are absolutely no earthquakes. When you are at peace, neither your volcano burst out, nor your earthquakes are there. When you are, your mind it has peace, peace of mind, peace of yourself then you are a most divine human being. But may I know how many of you know you, within you and outside you? How many of you get up in the morning with sip, simple one thing? I am bountiful, beautiful, and blissful. How many of you? Come on. That's a good start. I give you my personal thing. I landed in Toronto, penniless, no luggage, no friends. Didn't know the country, didn't know where to go. I sat on the airport for four hours. I don't know what to do. Anyway, I went to Toronto and I walked. Somebody took away my shoes. So I walked wrapping papers on my feet when the snow was all around and Toronto is a pretty cold city. And I walked and people used to see Many knew me in India. They knew how powerful and what kind of man I was. Man walking with six orderlies and 
in command and everything. You don't enjoy those facilities here in America. You're all poor. You don't know. You go to a restaurant to be served. Their people are served in their bed if they choose so. But anyway, in Toronto, I used to walk and people knew me. And some people tauntingly would say, how you feel? I'll say blissful. Oh my God, your situation is so terrible. I say, when it was not. Planet Earth is not my home. Everything is terrible here. What are you bothering about? You know, you were enjoying India. I said, well, I'm enjoying here too. Act is act. Actor has to act. Whatever the role he's given, he acts. My idea is that if I act given a bastard role, I should act as a perfect bastard. And if I am given a role of a perfect divine, I should act as a perfect divine. Actor has no personality of his. Script is already written. And that's what Nanak said. Pehle bani pache sri. Your destiny is pre-written. Body was given accordingly to you. But there's no understanding. There's no depth in our mind. You know how shallow we are? And how circuits are off? We never understand that my soul and everybody's soul is the same soul and every soul is a part of the divine soul, the God. We are all one. And you cannot buy with all the wealth in the world one breath. That's why they call you Adami. If breath comes, Adami, one dumb, means one breath. That's two seconds. That's your lifespan. And look how many arrangements we make. Millions. These tragedies, which happens in the cities, in the streets, in the home, and in your personal life, they're all caused by you. God is not responsible for them. You are responsible. Because you suffocate the divinity with your ego. And you justified your actions by rational and logic thinking. That's why I always say intellectuals are not intelligent. Your life will fail you when you do not make it limitless. So long you are confining your limits, you are in a dungeon. You are a prisoner of the rib cage. That's what you are. You're nothing more than that. In Toronto, I used to sing, one day the glory shall come. Is a poem. One day the day shall come when all the glory shall be thine. People shall say it is yours and I shall deny not mine. Will you read her further lines? It is, the, it is the poem of that man who at that moment had no friend, no place, no food, and nothing to walk in sub-zero temperature. Alien to a country, landed immigrant, nobody ever recognized, and those who recognized, they turned their face. Bliss. Bliss is when you are in bliss. When the pair of opposite do not affect you. Bountiful is when within you, you have a relationship with your soul. You know all is okay. That's the bounty. Bountiful 
blissful. And beautiful is when in the total adversity yourself, you can talk the highest. These are three statuses. This is the trinity of a man. Bountiful, blissful, and beautiful in action. In action. I was talking to some Indians today. They said, God, sir, we love you very much, but you are so rude and we are scared of you. I said, why not? You should be, because you don't do anything right. What's wrong with me? Well, it's my job to tell you you're idiots. There's nothing wrong in that. It's my job. I'm mean, not a spiritual teacher. My job is to see you acting against your spirit and bust you up. Well, sometimes we misunderstand. I said, there's no misunderstanding. Either you get punishment from a law of double jeopardy. Either get punished by me or by God, which way I choose. Make your own choice. But you think I see you wrong and I'm not going to poke my nose into you, then it's difficult. I say, you're justifying all of you didn't come, few of you came, right? Well, some thought, learned that you will be there. I said, that's true. We are feeding these people. I said, this is God. God is coming and eating up. And you all have prepared good food and you are serving. God is serving. God is eating. God is hungry. And God cooks. You don't believe that. You see how blind you are, all of you? Earth rotates. Hey, how many miles? 380 miles per hour when we are still? Something like that. Huh? Oh, she has those figures. <coughs> well, let us say. Huh? Yeah, some many miles you move per hour when you are totally sitting still. People think there should be a miracle. I tell you the miracle. In 24 hours, Earth revolve on the axle and you are not thrown in space. Isn't that a miracle? And 365 days and a quarter, it goes through the orbit. Isn't that a miracle? But you should have a sensitivity and beauty to see that, feel that. You should have totality to recognize totality. You should have infinite sense to realize infinity. In Rome, I was teaching a course, and I end up crying in the middle of it. And I said, forget I'm teaching. What I'm teaching is no good. Uh, let me take care of your pain. I said, you have so much pain. I can't. I can feel that you're a human being and so much hurt, so much in pain. You're so much unsure of your... If you cannot have a relationship with Atma, the soul, how can you have a relationship with Paramatma, the God? I know you all. You tell me I'm wrong. I am. And I like it. At least you have seen 50% of me, which is wrong. And if God is merciful, you'll find other 50% which is right. Nobody knows anything. You all guess. Last spirituality is obey, serve, love, and accept. impossible to do. I'm not saying it very kindly, it's a reality.
When some people came to me, they said, well, our teacher has told this and he's dead wrong. And I say, I agree, he's dead wrong. What is your advice? You know him, you can call him. I said, no, you go and be dead wrong with him. Teacher is a teacher. Go. He's dead wrong. Will you call him? I said, no. Why? I say, he's dead wrong. What should we do? I said, go and pray and go along with him. Why so, sir? I still laugh infinity is when teacher is wrong, is shame to God. Not to you. And decide and go wrong. And God will come through. Exactly when they reach back. And the teacher said, oh, a week ago, you know that we discussed that thing. That's a dead wrong. We're not going to do that. They thought I telephoned. They called me to thank you. I said, no, I never said a word. We never believe that this planet belongs to God. We never believe we belong to God. We have our duality and reservation. Today, Guru Shabbat was very good. It is a duality in my mind and it is maya around me. How confused I am, what I can do. I'm not saying anybody of you are wrong other than anybody is a standardized, notarized idiot. Because you can, if this lifetime, I, you, us, we, we cannot recognize the infinity of God. We lost the trip. Useless. You have to do something to rise above this limit. I'm not criticizing. I'm just awakening your Kundalini. All I'm saying, wake up. This is not your home. It can burn beyond you. Your real home is that infinite home. You have been with me for 23 years, many of you. And I have been calling you with one thing. All is all in big or small. And actually, if you write the word small, S-M-A-L-L, -L, all is in contained. My advice to every woman is, as in this spelling, you contain a man. Woman contains a man, she contains he in it. Female contains male. Contain the man. Otherwise, forget. Don't play this love game. It's not going to work. If you cannot contain a man, bow out and jump in Santa Monica, nearest water. <laughs> you are not a woman, period. For that man, you are not a woman. You are a human being. He is a human being. Then clash. Clash is not a harmony. One gives, one take. One takes, one give. There comes an understanding. There comes mutual understanding, harmony. And what is the understanding? Stand under. Stand under. That's the understanding. Otherwise, there's no understanding. What is the problem? Problem is we do not grow. We do not stretch ourselves. We are not vast enough. Our limit is our heckle. It kills us every day. So what has we become? We have become trendy. We have become faddish. So what do we live? 
We do not live with facts, we live with facets. Factuality is gone. Facets are overtaken our life. Let us see what in few minutes we can do. I promise it will be a very pleasant class. But you know how much pleasant I can be, it's very limited. <laughs> well, I know my limit, it's not. It's not practical to lie to you, but I just try to seduce you to come to the class. That's what I said last time. And it was not all correct. But I have the privilege to lie, because I lie all the time. Because what I know if I start telling you all, I run away. There's not a one person to deal with. Maybe one day I'll reach that stage and age that I'll stop lying to you and start telling that, 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 and you will never see me on the street again and get into the lane. Soon, as I'm getting older, the stage is going to come. Meanwhile, many of you are young, ruin your youth. When you are middle age, be confused. In old age, be miserable and lonely. Those are the three things you know. Uh huh. The network. You know, when you are young, you are stupid. Your heart warm, loving, dreaming. You expand so much that you do not know where the ground is. In the middle age, you are so confused. And the medically, they call it med middle age crisis. When you are old, you are so lonely. <coughs> There's not a person to relate to you. And is that the end you are going to shape up? Huh? Not fair. Not fair. Not fair to our own existence. It's not fair. You are cruel to yourself. You're not fair to yourself. You have the right. You have the birthright to be happy. You have the birthright to be in ecstasy. You have the birthright to be intuitive. You have the birthright to be happy, graceful, intuitive, and over and above divine. Dig your dignity. Isn't that what we used to say? When you were hippies, dig your dignity. All right, let us dig our strength today. Where is our vitality? Sex life is very good. You have been doing all intercourses. But this intercourse will be very special. <laughs> this intercourse is between pituitary and pineal, and it's relating to the third navel point. It'll be, I'll be working on the third and sixth and seventh. Okay? Let's get to it. Oh, these are the gifts I got? Oh, wow. I got Conscious Cookery, my own book, cookbook, <laughs> from Vegetable with Love. Yeah, I needed them. I don't have them. Somebody wanted it so badly. Where did this assessment to treat them? Huh? Okay, you should start treating me first. Then it'll work out. Ah. Uh, uh, we are going to work now, and uh, I'm using sound and connecting rhythm of the sound, and it will be uh, a kind of a ultra sound you will hear, but basically what you should do, come along, this system is accurately correct. It does put some pressure. And uh, pressure is ready. <laughs> Everything forty degree back, total pressure on your shoulders. Hello, machos, gold club. Come on. It's a simple posture, it has nothing to bother. Your chest out, chin in, go like in ecstasy. Pretend, it, I was not faking, that's what we know. Let's fake, put your neck out, and with the navel point, breath of fire. 
You have a God, why you come to this class? Come here to see a movie? <laughs> if we do not give justice, why we are teaching? We are faking, lying, I'm tired of it. Come on, come on, get to this. You know, you big machos, go to gold club, big muscle men, sexy and horny and you remember you the way you start gasping you think you are the biggest what is that man was who was champion of intercourse what do you call him something like that uh huh in actually chin up all shoulder hand fingers open and light everything no stiffness in muscles and breath of fire with the power of the navel. Move navel, what are you trying to do? Move your navel. Life is just relative. I know you have never done this, but God, today you can do it. You won't fail if you try your best. Come on, you need B12 injection? Hey, you guys. Come on, come on, let's do it. Why I am just balancing sugar and sodium point. That's all. Aqua puncture, they call it. Hey, stretch out your hands. <laughs> <laughs> whole night it'll make you urinate, don't worry about it. Come on, stretch. Seva, stretch back. What is that? You don't want to enjoy ecstasy? Stretch back a little bit. Yeah, it won't. It doesn't hurt. It's okay. Just do it for God's sake. You'll be fine. And now open your mouth and pull your tongue out. It's a dark breath, no big deal. It's much lighter access than, than all you have been doing. What's so wrong about it? Open up from the navel. Why you should eat less if you can't do this? What is wrong with me? You became fat, I didn't ask you. Come on, let's, let's, let's get to it. We have the right to experience. Aha, open up your mouth, cool up your inner system. This wonderful tongue has to come out. And breathe from the navel, not from the diaphragm. Pull. You are not going to get a heart attack. You'll be fine. Come on, do it. Young girl, look at you. At your age, I could do anything. Ah. Pull, 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 pull. Get going. Move. There's nothing wrong. Yeah, yeah, you can cough. That's okay. One thing an American I like is that love to do things which are new. <laughs> That's why I give you very new exercise. Come on, you have to go one more minute. I can't stop you. One more minute, 60 seconds, God. Pull, pull. Go back a little bit. You are all coming forward. I near T7 and T6 is not a very happy, but you know that. Pull, pull, put pressure. All right, put your hands up together. Together. Lock them. Not like this. Lock them like this. Hold them solid and pull up. Pull up. Now fight with your own gravity. Pull up. 
pull up your arm. Actually, you are pulling our armpit. That is where all three nervous system meet. Pull, pull, upward, pull. Pressurize. Whatever bent is, don't worry about it. Pull. Pull. Fight. Fight your gravity. It's okay. Fight your gravity by your will. I'm not asking you. I'm asking you, you fight your gravity now. If you fight your gravity, you will be very beautiful. Come out of it. Fight your gravity. Pull yourself up. It's a double force. Your gravity is pulling you down. Your will is pulling you up. And fight is on. Fight harder. And keep the posture. Hold your hand, neutralize. See the palms of the hand touch. That's the tragic part of it. I don't like this myself, but sometimes I do. <laughs> well, I, how can I teach if I do not know the experience? I have the experience, terrible exercise, I know that. Your hands, listen, there are two faults you will do. Your hands will flip out. And this bent, this is how it is. That's how you have to do. Your rib cage, your spine, your vertebras, your disc, all must fit in. Pull against gravity. Pull. Keep there then. Don't, don't come down. Stay up. Good. Stay up. It doesn't it hurts, doesn't hurt. It will give you healthy. It will give you all, all you need. Pull against your gravity. You old guys, you're gonna have senility. <laughs> yeah, that is where senility comes in. Pull, pull, pull up. Pull up and keep it there, no down, no down. Yeah, yeah, one more minute. Up, up, up. Hey, you are a very good student. Come on, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Yeah, stay there, stay, stay, that's good. By what is wrong to be miserable is okay. Little more miserable is not going to hurt. <laughs> Come on, pull, pull. One, two, three, relax. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Yeah, this is called ecstasy. <laughs> you know, it's a relief. When after 14 years from prison, you come out, you say, how good you feel? You dance, you jump, right? Now, summer is coming in. Hey, wait a minute, I'm giving you these exercises for summer. I'll not be here. And I'm telling you how powerful you can improvise your own health. You don't have to depend on anybody. One is you pull against gravity, always. But before doing that, you have to put your balance. And balance is this side, this side is sodium and this side is your sugar point, potassium. And these two points are only adjustable by no other system by this. Watch me, I can show you very classified situation. And see my belly. And when you pull like this, see how much you can pull. You don't know. Flexibility of the spine here. You can pull yourself about an inch. 
you want to and you will be new as much you can stand normally three minutes but if you can do for four minutes but don't exceed five even you become perfect in it because then you need an hour of rest otherwise everything will look so little to you <laughs> second thought is now we are going to work with our situation as it is my heart beats my blood circulates but my glands greet answer is yes or no no they don't screech at the required proportion. You understand? Now you know what it is? See? This, put it on the sun finger. Sun finger, not the mercury, is easy this way, but sun finger is a little difficult. And knock it down. And this is what you are going to do. Watch this. same position you go circulating and it will take care of all the glandular system and it will make it secrete. I want you in summer keep on doing these exercises it will keep you young energetic you don't have to rely on drugs you don't have to take pills to sleep Move up and down. Yeah, down. And like as I reach here, like this, then go down exactly the same way. Then go up, same way. Move, move, move up and down. Ha uh ha, -huh, move up and down. Don't we fluctuate that way in our mood? Little go down and then go up and like that. Little circle in a very humble way. Keep going. Hey, Rama, keep your neck up. Yeah, now you're right. Move, 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 move. It's not going to stop even you look at me miserably. <laughs> These kind of exercises which totally do us the best, we don't do. We only do exercises in which we feel macho. <laughs> These are very subtle exercises. They are very good for your system. Move your glandular system. Glands are guardian of health and the glandular secretion proportionally must go to your blood. You have to change your blood stream exactly in seven minutes. And it's only <laughs> two. <laughs> huh? What? He's hitting you? He's your husband. What should I tell him? <laughs> it's legal. Until you don't file a complaint. <laughs> These men, they're fine. Come on, <laughs> keep moving. <laughs> Move, for God's sake, keep moving. You have to go up and down, both at the same time. You have to keep moving. You will be miserable, that I know. I do it myself, I'm not denying it, but that's the way you can have secretion of all the glandular system in the bloodstream and glands are guardian of health. It's a very scientific explanation to make you do miserable things. What should I do? I wish something better should have known to me and I would have tried that. <laughs> sun finger, sun, bottom mount of the sun. Your thumb must connect, that's most important, that's very important. Sun, 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 sun mount. And Pinky will tell you that and then move and not slowly. More, more, powerful, fast. Oh, it hurts. That's okay. Who cares, right? Come on.
people, Europe, dry on autobahn speed, 100 a day. Everybody knows the accident is, everybody will die, but still they love to do it. It's a very good adventure. Move. Ha ha. Move. When you are young, you think you had it all. When you are middle-aged, you do not know what you lost and what you gained. In old age, you wish you should be young again. What a wonderful life. Come on, it's beautiful. <laughs> Come on. It's really, it's a, it's a very well-planned life. It's fantastic, isn't it? By move, move, move. Watch, go slow when you don't move fast. Move, move. Get angry now. Get wild, angry. Do it with a lot of anger. Ah, just get angry. Mood, mentally, hypnotically, get mad. Now, don't create a lot of noise that this roof will go away, but just move with that, that anger, that velocity. Come on for two minutes. Angrily, move angrily. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That really, it will do you good more than anything else you've done so far. Move angrily up and make some angry face too. You're too gentle, kid. Yeah, mm. yeah. Make, make, make angry face. Show you are in anger. Two more minutes, that's it. Oh no, mother, watch is moving. That's all right. I'll tell you when it finishes, but just do it. Angrily. Angrily, angrily, angrily. Hallelujah. Come on. Come on, say it are moving on, but very slow speed. Move, 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 move. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's come, 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 please. Come on, just come on, that's not fair. Thirty more seconds. Do it, do it hard. Do it hard, do it hard, really. Because after this, this exercise which follows is a must. Come on, come on, quick, quick. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Okay, stretch your hand and right up, left down, and move like this. Oh, what? Hurry up. Balance your spine now. I'm not taking uh, any very practice, but I'm saying it's one of the best things you can do. Up and down, balance, balance. Right, upward, palm open. Left, palm down. Move, move, spine, move spines, move spine. Fast, it's not as slow. It's a kind of dance, isn't it? Move, 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 move. You were very lucky I came late. Huh? You must be thinking I may not show up. Wow. I said move. It will do you good for the nervous system and for the spine. Adjust your own spine. Move. Govinda, you know how to move, but why you are so shy about it? Where is Dr. Bhagru saying? He doesn't want to adjust his spine. He adjusts everybody's. Move, move, move. Is there a football, football match tonight? Well, there must be something is not here. 
Move, 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 move. You have to move. It also will balance the hemisphere. Move. It's a very important exercise for the brain, spine, and whole thing. Move. Oh, no, it's not that bad. You say, oh, it's bad, but it's not that, that much I know. It's not that bad. It's a polarization. It's a most of the most perfect way to polarize. And now, for the last minute, you will be fast to your utmost honesty. <coughs> Just one minute. Fast to your utmost honesty. Close your eyes and go wild. One minute. One minute only at your maximum wildness. Fifteen seconds left. Take advantage. Okay, inhale and stand like this. Inhale and stand like this. And close your eyes and breathe slowly. Long, deep and slowly. Put your thumb at Mercury Mount. Four fingers straight, eyes closed. And from the closed eyes, look at your chin. Now, if you can survive this minutes, you will love it. It's very important. I did today these in dream. <laughs> Physically, I know they hurt, but we got to do it. <laughs> Come on. I didn't lie. I say I did them in dream. So, I mean, what you can say to me? Nothing. The best way to lie to somebody is when you want to tell him weird, tell him I had a dream. You dream anyway. Day dream, night dream, worst is nightmares. But just tell him I had a dream. This. You are going somewhere and one dog came and he ate your calf and the other ate came and ate your arm. And, and then I saw you, you were eating a chicken while walking. So everything was eat, eat, eat. Come on, come on, dream something good. Dream some fantasy. Look at your chin. You will never have a nightmare if this meditation is perfected. Look at your chin and take your fantasy and play it. We all live near Hollywood, play the fantasy. Close your eyes, look at your chin. It's okay. Play it. Play it, play it. Personify it. Personify it, play it.
play that last tape if you have please please for your sake we are clearing the unconscious and saving the conscious nightmares that's all steady this is a very steady meditation it will do for you which you can do in couple years in couple minutes so don't go with it just just keep the posture and play the fancy god is within me your meditation keep looking at your chin you are lost the focus from closed eyes start visualizing everything whatever the words are visualize Big and small Ooh. 
try to hold the breath. Breathe very slowly. Inhale deep, 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 hold the breath, hold the breath and synchronize your body please. Let the energy be dispelled to all parts, every molecule of the body. Synchronize totally, hold the breath tight, synchronize hard in this posture. Let it go. Inhale deep again. Deep, deep this time really, open up your ribcage. Now hold tight and now synchronize or squeeze your every molecule. Every molecule, I mean it. Toes to head, let it go. Now this is the last chance you have and breathe in deep. Hold the breath. At the count of 16, let the breath go. One. Squeeze two, squeeze three, squeeze four, five, six, squeeze seven, eight, nine, squeeze ten, squeeze eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, squeeze fifteen. Let it go. Relax. See, it was the easiest class I've taught. <laughs>
I kept my word with you, right? Okay, now, uh, just do that cat and just dance a little bit. Hey, play for a few minutes. Da 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 da, just dance. Move your body so that you can digest what you have created. At this moment, the blood must circulate through the body three times. So you got to move every part. Whichever part you won't move will be weaker. Good, good. Move the shoulders. Come on, come on. It's a very good movement. First dance the mankind learned. this song She 
was doing pretty good. See, if it comes to Italian, what they're going to do to it? Cylindrically. nice of you sit down put ong namo guru dev namo please put your hands here and this and close your eyes and look at the chin from the close eyes and the hand must be solid totally compressed against each other as one piece and the two thumbs must be under the eyes in that cavity, don't press your eyes too hard with them. And ladies, if you are nailed, don't go and puncture your skin. <laughs> sit solid, sit stand. Oh, and please repeat the words. is the most powerful prayer for your own self. Inhale. Oh my 
breath, give me life, give me strength, give me peace. Delightfully enlighten me. Let the breath go. Inhale deep again. Oh my breath, give me love. Give me the sight to feel all in me, within me and around me. Give my power to not hate but love and love alone. Let it go. Inhale deep. <coughs> oh my love, breath, my sweet breath, oh my breath of my life, my friend, my guardian, my sensitivity, give me peace of mind, healthy, happy, and holy. Make me bountiful, beautiful, and brightful. Bless me. Let it go. Relax. May the long time sun shine upon you. All love surround you. And the blue light within you guide your way on. May the long time sun shine upon you. Bless us, bless us, bless us, O Divine within us, bless us. Prevail, prevail, prevail within us, around us, for us. Give us the consciousness, give us the consciousness to be healthy, happy, and holy. Give us the ecstasy we can serve. Give us the blissful state of mind that we can love. Give us the bountiful status so we can treat all with kindness and compassion. Give us all as we are in thy image. Keep us all in thy care and favor. Bless those who need thee. Bless all who are with thee. Let each breath be bountiful forever. Satnam. Well, folks, as it comes, as it goes, I'll be leaving for summer for New Mexico tomorrow, and we will meet at the summer sauces. Many of you will come, many of you will not come. You have your priorities. But this age of Aquarius, it has its own priorities. And some of the ladies will come to the ladies' camp, some won't come because they didn't plan it right. Life goes on. Feel not guilty, but feel stupid. <laughs> <laughs> because, because you don't have time for yourself. You don't have time to work on yourself. You don't care, take care of yourself. And finally, it all goes upside down. I understand that. And I'm no exception to this. I didn't take care of myself for a long time. I overworked and tried to save the whole humanity, thinking that I'm the only one who can do it. But it didn't work out that way either. So, if you need good air, Sometimes you feel like get out of the smog and you do not like San Francisco and you want to go towards south. And it is nearer than Acapulco. It's called Santa Fe. If you want to be a woman, come to the ladies' camp, learn to be a woman. If you want to joy and enjoy your own grace, come to summer sauces. And if you cannot do anything, you are so ridiculously busy, at least come to the Peace Prayer Day. So we all can sit together and pray for each other. With these words, I say thank you and goodbye. 
hopefully in some time in September, October, November, whenever. If your prayers are with me and I live a little longer, I'll show up in New Mexico for day in and day night in my spirit, but I'll be here physically. That's a land of enchantment. We didn't say it wrong. It is. It's not the hectic country and high walled country like New York. It's also not very international and metropolitan like Los Angeles. And it's is not, it is not, it's a very simple place where still there are adobe houses made with earth and straw and the roofs are made with bigas. Though they cost per square foot more than all you have here, but it's a land still free. Water is genuine, air is good, people are simple. Is one part of America which is called land of enchantment. Our elders must be right to name it that way. I shall be there, come in any time. Normally as a routine, at 11 a.m. every day, I sit under cherry tree and I teach. And at one o'clock is a lunch and then everybody goes home. The rest of the schedule is belong to locals. We have wonderful activities this whole summer. We like to do our best, and especially these days when times are going to be challenging. You need your strength. However, those who don't come and stay here, work hard and take care of yourself. Drive carefully and don't go berserk. Los Angeles always have one phenomenon or another. Sometimes they start burning it, sometimes they start shooting on freeways. And God knows what is the new idea in their mind and head for this summer. But I'm very grateful to you as a community that you took care of yourself. And I'm very grateful that you made a command center. And not only you take care of your community, you took care of all your neighbors and surrounding. You did a wonderful job. For that, my prayers are with you, and I bless you. But it's not over yet. So please regulate your life accordingly. Be careful. <coughs> Try to be healthy, happy, and holy. God be with you. Satnam. Now go home. They gave me a job starting in January. My old position, I had, they called me. They would, they would like to have me there starting yes. in January. It's a good position yes. in Rome.